Greetings, friends. I'm Hazel Archer Ginsburg, striving, ever striving to embody Anthroposophia here at the Great Inland Sea of Chicago, where I'm the festivals coordinator at the Rudolf Steiner branch. I also serve on the Central Regional Council of the Anthroposophical Society, and I'm the founder of Reverse Ritual, understanding anthroposophy through the rhythms of the year. And I am honored to invite you to join me at the Sacred Gateway as we explore festivals for the dead, the unborn, and the evolution of earth, then and now. And speaking of now, because of the circumstances of our world right now, we've been compelled to move our Sacred Gateway online. And I felt that to be a real calling, that I, we should take up this opportunity to explore what spiritual science has to say about the connection between ourselves, those across the threshold, and the causes of viral epidemics on Earth. So, in our first session, we will grapple with how to find the karmic connections that shape our current events. And Yes, we, our work with those on the other side will give us answers about the causes and purpose of illness and the ways of healing ourselves, our beloved dead, and our Mother Earth. And our dear Dr. Steiner, he gives us this, this wonderful quote that I'll share. It is urgent, urgently necessary for humankind to become conscious of the fact that the so-called dead and the spiritual world are working into the actual details of physical existence for good or ill. So yeah, a lot to think about. This theme is very rich, very topical, and I'm sure you have a lot of questions that um, we can explore during our time together. And then in our second session, we will delve into some of the ancient origins of the many cultural expressions that work with, celebrate, and honor our beloved dead. And perhaps you'll become inspired to renew or you know, create your own tradition. And we will also ask, how can we prepare the way for the unborn? Those waiting to cross the rainbow bridge into a new incarnation. Dear friends, it's, it's no small thing. By doing this important work, we create a firm foundation for the future evolution of humanity. And we will ask many questions when, when we're together, uh, trying to, to live into our own prenatal commitments, right? Let's ask ourselves, what, what, what is our destiny? What did we come here? What, what, did, we come in, what did we sign up for? Yeah, how can we remember and, and implement the blueprint that we created with the, the highest spiritual beings before we came into this life? So maybe you can start to think about uh, you know, what is your destiny? You know, what did you sign up for? And we will explore this practice of spirit recalling by asking ourselves, yeah, where did I come from? And this will lead us into inquire about where we're headed, right? And uh, this idea of practice spirit, spirit sensing. And then how do we practice this idea of spirit beholding in our living thinking as we look toward our future and beyond into our, our life between death and rebirth? And of course, these are the kind of questions that we can bring to our beloved ones already across the threshold and to those waiting to be born, as well as to our future selves. So really, the question becomes, why wait? Why not begin the work of digesting these insights now, together? Blessings, friends. I look forward to working with you. Be in good health. Peace. <laughs>